Well, the district attorney says what started out as just neglect a long time ago led to severe abuse in recent years. The DA says these 13 children were starved, tied up, beaten, and in some cases, strangled. David and Louise Turpin are the Paris parents accused of shackling their children with chains and padlocks. But today, they're the ones bound by chains as they entered pleas of not guilty to charges of torture and child abuse. You know, sometimes in this business, we're faced with looking at human depravity, and that's what we're looking at here. The abuse is thought to have spanned decades, starting when they lived in this home in Fort Worth, Texas, intensifying as the years rolled by. Some of the worst abuse allegedly happening inside this home in Paris. Victims report that as a punishment, they began to be tied up, first with ropes. When that victim was able to escape the ropes, uh, these defendants eventually began using chains and padlocks to chain up the victims to their beds. District Attorney Mike Hestron says the children were not allowed to have toys and they were given very little to eat. The parents would apparently buy food, pies, apple pies, pumpkin pies, leave it on the counter, let the children look at it, but not eat the food. Although the children were homeschooled, Hestron says they didn't learn much. Many of the children didn't know what a police officer was. The 17 year old, when asked if there was medication or pills in the home, didn't know what medication or pills were. Defense attorneys spoke after court about the difficulties of handling a case with worldwide attention. It makes it more difficult because people uh, who are not in the courtroom begin to form opinions about you know, what happened and who's guilty and of what charges. And David Turpin is also charged with one count of a lewd act on a child under the age of 14. The DA would not go into detail, only saying that the alleged victim was one of Turpin's daughters. Both Turpins remain behind bars. Bail set at $12 million each.